This is tough legislation to get through because, you know, again, the president is only trying to get Republican votes, but Republican votes are very diverse. There are people in the Republican caucus who want to see Obamacare repealed outright, uh, and those in the Republican caucus who are very concerned about preserving some of the more popular aspects of the legislation. This is a very tough moment for the president. It's his first major piece of legislation, and he failed to get it through. Uh, and there really isn't a clear pathway for how to get repeal done. Um, he doesn't have enough votes to repeal the law outright without continuing some of the more popular aspects of Obamacare. Uh, and he really doesn't have a way to, um, to get it done in another mechanism. So, um, you know, it's tough to get legislation at this point. For starters, this is great news for Medicaid recipients who might have lost their insurance under this law. Uh, and I think that, that it's fair to say also that you had a lot of governors who were very, very worried about this legislation uh, because of the potential reduction in Medicaid funding to their states. Well, I think the president has realized that, in fact, health care is hard. Um, and look, with respect to Congressman Ryan, this is not easy, easy legislation to pass. He has a very diverse caucus. And the fact of the matter is that uh, the caucus lacks consensus at this point on how to proceed. Look, the president will not have been the first politician to have underestimated how difficult it is to get health care reform. In fact, now he has something significant in common with Hillary Clinton. Uh, and health care legislation is very difficult. It's a tenth of the economy uh, and growing. It's a place where economics really affect people's well-being. And uh, we have a lack of consensus in this country on what constitutes great health care.